Thank you, Mr. Speaker. When I presented this bill in committee, I made the statement it was with no great joy that I had to present the legislation. And I pray that in the future, myself nor any other member of this body has to do the same. House Bill 397 will add 15 additional disaster and emergency days for our schools. It will also, in doing so, that will allow our students to be able to meet their criteria for their days of being in school, as well as the contracts of our classified, uh, certified and non-certified employees. With the devastating tornadoes that took place on December the 10th, December the 11th, we've seen our school personnel, our students, the impact that it's taken upon them and their families. This is a way by adding these extra days to allow them to get their lives back to a little bit of normalcy. At this time, I'd like to yield to the gentleman from Graves, please. Chair, I recognize the gentleman from Graves. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. I rise in support of this bill. Uh, I had the opportunity to witness the uh, Mayfield and Graves County folks in action after the tornado hit. Uh, they, they, were, they jumped in and volunteered, helped uh, receive donations and, and disperse donations and helped with cleanup. And, I, I think the uh, 10 days that Mayfield was out of school and the five days that Graves County was out of school, those kids that participated in that process uh, learned much more than they would have in the classroom. And, and I appreciate the uh, gentleman from Christian bringing the bill and thank you for your support. General from Christian. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. And I want to say thank you to the gentleman from Graves because he assisted me as we were putting this legislation together. There are three school districts that will use 10 or more days. As was mentioned, Mayfield Independent, Dawson Springs Independent. The uh, Christian County School District will only be one school, Pembroke Elementary, that used 10 or more days. As I said, by doing this, this will allow these families who as this spring continues on, these families will be working every day, working on their property, trying to get things straightened up, organized all the way through summer. And this will just allow them to be able to get back to what their schedule was before the tornadoes hit. And as I said, move toward a bit of normalcy. If there are no questions, I'd move passage of House Bill 397.